can you hear me now? I'm not registering as I do this. No. Oh man, it worked. Oh God, it's a miracle. Flippin' did it. Hi, we did it. Did it. Um, so. Oh, we. Yeah. Basement. A. Flooded. Ew. Check. 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 Keep going. Hello. Good. Okay. We're working on it. We're getting there. Okay. Cool. So we had to move the studio around. The the studio slash basement flooded, so that's what Mr. Chomp Chomp was dealing with while he was streaming with us. Speaking of which, anybody get to watch Mr. Chomp Chomp? How did he do? Did he do okay? Do you think he did all right? See? Yes? No? Should I fire him? Just tell me if I should fire him. He did okay? Okay. I don't have to kill him. That's the important thing. All right. No, he did great. Okay, cool. Yeah, uh, that guy, I don't even, like, if you guys see Mr. Chomp Chomp, I want you guys to understand how much that guy did for us this weekend. Like, before I thank a billion people that we met this weekend, Mr. Chomp Chomp, number one in my heart right now. Realsies. He handled the plumber. He handled the flooding. He was taking buckets of water out at a time from my, my basement. So, Mr. Chomp Chomp, here's for you. When I get a beer, it's for you. I'll buy you a beer. Any beers. So, for the next couple of weeks, we're going to be shooting from what it basically amounts to my dog's room. Yeah. Very small little bedroom upstairs. No green screen. Ask you used to talking to the audience. Yes, we're in the doghouse. So, yeah. That's, that's the exciting news. Now, PAX itself was pretty badass. And you guys can see in the background, we've got the rolling slideshow for you guys to kind of see what's going on. And if you guys see anything in a picture that you have questions, but yeah. Oh, hi. I'm sorry you have to head to work, Silly Smacks. This is Athena. Hi, Silly. You did it. So, beans. I know. I know. Hi, Athena. Hi, Athena. Well, you said you didn't have to. Lost her? Not by the mic. I have to yell for you guys to hear me? Well, you should be used to yelling. That's kind of your thing. Like, yell. Ah! Audio this! <laughs> You guys start working night shift? Well, I'm going to start streaming in the afternoon more, early evening. I don't know what your night shift is like, but it sucks that you're going to be gone, man. The weekends. You got weekends. Be right back, forcing brother into the stream. He should automatically be he here. He should be here. Damn it. We have lots of things to talk about with Pax. Pax was awesome. How awesome was Pax? Pax was badass. Badass. Max was super badass. Let's see if we can just shrink this just a little bit. That bitch is sideways. That's okay. Yeah. Everybody can just. Yeah, just tilt your head. Like, she's a hot Liliana. We dig it. All right. Um. So, at like two o'clock on Thursday morning before we left, 
I called Athena and said, hey, go. Yeah. He is cocking. Mystic, he's cocking. Brother is cocking right now, and you felt the need to share that. Or did you mean cooking? That's just cock. Like fapping? <laughs> Brother, come on, man. Oversharing is what that is. No, so, I don't know. I just kind of got a wild hair up my ass at like 2 a.m. and was like, hey, Athena, do you want to go? And she told me a bunch of excuses, and I didn't want to hear them. So I ended up going. So she ended up going. That handsome devil over there. Little sideways stuff. Those guys are way better looking than that guy, though. So, let's see. What did we do? Uh, I looked for parking a whole lot. What else happened at the con? This guy got really drunk. I don't get drunk. I don't drink. I don't drink at all. That's typical. <laughs> I don't drink. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm a wholesome young man. I knew it. That I'd get drunk? Yeah. So, basically, Nomad decided to feed me a bunch of drinks and then turned me loose on the Mixer Partner Party. And he made lots of friends. I made a lot of friends. He made lots of friends. I, at Cincinnati? I don't know what you're talking about with Cincinnati. We did not try to break into the pool at Cincinnati. I'm back. He is coming. Oh, so he's done cocking. Okay, good. What's up, Rebus? Rebus, what's going on, man? So, I'm a simple man. Call up, me a dude? redneck, but I'm contrary to the core. Oh, so, yeah. Uh, let's see. We saw lots of cosplayers. I saw that really sweet car right there. That sick. car is freaking amazing. Um, we made friends with lots of other Mixer partners, like the very, very strange and dapper Gouda. He's amazing. Tachyon and Bobo and... Oh, I want to remember his name. I'm so bad at names. I'm so bad at names. I know who that one is. That is a terrible picture. That's a great Thank picture you of you. Guys. They took lots of pictures without me noticing. We're not ninjas at all. Who's that? DJ! DJ Hero and another Bobo. So they had this really cool uh, B Bands part, not partner thing, but like a B Bands promo thing. Basically, the, the convention hall ended at 6 p.m. every day. And then everyone kind of filtered out to go do things the rest of the night. The first thing to do after 6 p.m. that night was to go to the B Bands party in the mall down at Riverside in San Antonio. It was really, really cool. We got to hang out, meet a lot of people. There's actually a really awesome group shot of everybody that was there that'll come up through the rotation at some point, I'll point out. Um, did anybody watch anything that happened at PAX this weekend? Oh, oh that's, Skofu. that's your man's. That's your man's <laughs> I got right Skofu's there. Digits. You did get Skofu's digits. Um, so, did anybody see anything from the Darwin Project this weekend? Because Darwin was all over the place. Like, the mixer booth was the Darwin booth, it was amazing. We had Fridge Network, Jethro Toll, and High School Walrus doing shout casting live, taking active polls. Like you can see right there, you can vote on different players, different things. It was Watched amazing. It all day. Yeah. It was amazing. It's a, it's a really good game. And going back to what we tested on earlier this summer, it's improved by leaps and bounds. Um, well, that's a good shot of the entire, well, not the entire that's floor, just the but that's one the back side. half. There we the go. Floor. That's the other side. There's the other there side. Yeah. Pretty cool. The Darwin Project was amazing. We got to hang out with staff. I got us these sweet free t-shirts. Check. Oh, They're pretty freaking cool. Yeah, I got them. Got to hang out with Bloody Marrow. If you guys don't know who Bloody Marrow is, he's one of the designers and also notorious for slaughtering noobs in the alpha testing. He killed me more than once. Yeah, it was really cool. Uh, Marrow was awesome. He was very French. Yeah, Bloody Marrow. Yeah. Very, very French. Um, fortunately, I could hear through his accent. You looked confused. Oh, I heard him. Did you? Sometimes. Sometimes. But you guys were all talking about the game, and I ain't played it before. So. All right, so you haven't played the game before. What did you think about it? Like, what did you notice about the game, and what did you like about it? I just want to play it. I want to play it now. That's what did, I want to did do. You, did you notice like how the gameplay worked at all? Did you 
pay attention? Yeah, I paid attention. Okay. So what do you like about what what do you like about that kind of survival game versus like Fortnite or PUBG where it's like this huge battle royal? This one's like only ten person. What parts of it did you like watching, even just as a viewer? I like how it goes the different the mixer interacts with Yeah. It's freaking cool. What what interactions did you like? Like I like the nuke. Like the I like nuke watching is, people yes, just the nuke. The nuke is like amazing. I, I like when and then um, that anti gravity is pretty cool too. Where you can do like the super big bouncy yeah. jumps. Did you happen to catch it when the shoutcaster called for a nuke of the final area, and they were like, the the game coding itself was like, you can't nuke the last area, silly game master. <laughs> no, I didn't catch that one. I think it was I think it was Jethro at that time, but he tried to nuke the final area and it wouldn't let him. They added a new raid while you're. Oh, uh, I wish they added a new raid. I got Final Fantasy 15 before we left for PAX, and I downloaded Type Zero. Let's see. Uh, one thing that I noticed that they added for Darwin, um, at least from alpha testing to now, is instead of it being, it used to be seven players in the game director. Now it's ten. They put ten people in those seven sectors, uh, and I think that's really super cool. And you can kind of see there. They changed the color of the zone outs. They used to just kind of gray them out. Now having them like red it out looks really good. Uh, oh, there's that dapper young fellow again. Um, we need those warlock. See, he's a warlock. And she says she's mastered the jump. I have. I have. But that's I like have. mastering the special limb. Look at all the mixer partners. Okay, that was the picture I was talking about. That's the B Bands party. All of the mixer partners and me sneaking in a little bit pretending to be. And then a Sika with blue hair. Oh, I loved this. Sika was so great. The Sika was amazing. Uh, that guy's okay. He needs a new hoodie, though. I'm thinking we should get him a mixer partner hoodie, so at least it's clean. I think that sounds like a great idea. Doesn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We need to get him a partner hoodie. What ways? What ways does she need to know? Like what? how to look so so fine on camera? Like just, What ways? What ways I'm are confused. we teaching her? Look at that face. No, Look at that. She hates that picture oh so much. Oh my god. <laughs> She's like, I wasn't ready for it. I haven't even slept. Yeah. Oh, Monster oh Hunter. God. Oh, Monster Hunter's only a couple weeks away. But yeah, the 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 Darwin stuff, uh, there's going to be open beta this weekend. So if you are a Steam user, Darwin is open beta, I believe, Friday through Sunday. We are going to do a lot of Darwin this weekend. A lot, a lot. I have a present for you, June. Oh, ooh, okay. Um, are they tickets to E3? Best present. Wait for it. Wait for it. Bobo was super cool, man. We had a really good time hanging out with him. Uh, Dave and Buster's, right? I think of the other. There's so many things that happened. I was so drunk. <laughs> At David Buster's. I vaguely remember being there. Bobo is really, really uh, cool. Oh. I was really happy Hi. to meet him. Him and DJ. Yeah, they, they they were the ones you were looking forward to the most just because they've been there for you. Yes. Not Metal Mario. He was cool, though. He was doing a lot of cool poses. Yeah, he was. Yeah, he was, like, flexing on people. Uh, okay, okay. Yeah, we'll we'll talk about that. Yeah, we'll, we'll definitely talk about that. Well, there was a lot of things that got talked about this weekend. Uh, not not the least being that we, Tina, myself, now, now being represented by the Marvel Factory in a sponsorship agreement. They're going to be doing a lot of cool new logos and fun things. And I was handing out Marvel Factory cards all weekend, trying to shake partners' hands and shake devs' hands and just put that card in people's hands, really. It was a really good time. Uh, I may or may not be able to acquire some discounts, but Marvel Factory is doing some really cool stuff as far as like helping streamers put together packages for layouts, overlays, websites, any kind of graphics. So I can't shout them out enough. And I will be, when we are done with this little chit chat, I'll have my new layout up and looking all pretty. He just Hold made on. my logo too. Exciting. I don't know that they added a new map in Fortnite. We're actually going to get to that when we're done here, just kind of covering all the pack stuff. And I've got a few things that I want to cover with the channel going forward, just because there's a couple of big items coming up that I would really, really need some help with. And 
this will tie back into PAX weekend, the flooding problem, and going forward with the channel. But the existing map is what got updated in Fortnite, and Athena and I are going to play that tonight. Uh, we're going to do a Fortnite stream after the fact. Yep. We're, we're going to try out all the new areas and get shot up a whole bunch. So It's crazy, because everybody's going to drop in the new areas. But that's exactly why we need to go there. We need to show them off. Or we can drop nearby, drop nearby, and then go charging in and pick up, like like hyenas, pick up your half dead team. Or get wrecked. Either or, or I wrecked. guess we'll Let's not get out. wrecked. Let's just not get wrecked. <laughs> we haven't played Fortnite in five days. We're gonna get wrecked no matter what. Longer for me. Well, get the internet. Yeah. My internet's yeah. gone, guys. If you don't. The front of the inside dude. me a freaking man. They erased it from Twitter, and it's not there. It's not there yet. What? It's not there yet. Mystic, you're breaking my heart. I was really hoping it'd be there. Last time you went to Comic-Con or PAX? Never. Well, Tubo, you should definitely make a point to go because they're a lot, a lot of fun. We got to play a lot of cool games that haven't come out yet. My personal favorite? What do you think? What? New games that we saw. The free oh, radicals Hunter. inside me are freaking, man. Monster Hunter? The Shapes and Beats. Oh, Shapes and Beats was really cool. Shapes and Beats is going to be amazing. Really, really cool. It, it blends kind of the musical game. The Everything happens in beat sequence. And it kind of ties that together with Ge Geometry Wars, which is like a almost like an Atari-like shooter. Uh, they don't announce anything into March, though. Yeah, what platform? But they had... Okay. They haven't announced platform, but you were definitely playing it on an Xbox controller. Yeah, I, I, I held it in an Xbox controller in my hand. So, just shapes and beats looks like a lot of fun. If you haven't looked into that at all, or if you can find any kind of like demo play of that, definitely check it out. Okay. Well, maybe they did it this afternoon. I don't know. Or maybe they're doing it tonight. Who even knows? So sad. I can't be sure if I can. See, we looked up the PAX East tickets, and Friday and Saturday are sold out. So, unless we have some mysterious benefactor, we're going to have a hard time getting in. But it would help with those partner badges. Yeah, I know. I don't know. Bashir, what's up? Zero, what's up, my dude? You just got off Fortnite. Nothing there. Gets to work. Please do. Oh, the thing, and this is specifically for you, Mike. The Hack South passes did not get approved. We, did, we weren't on the list. I did check. I did remember to check. So we might just have to do it earlier this time. And I am going to be... Yeah. Yeah, that's <laughs> yes. an Athena. Hi. Yeah, I, I kidnapped her. I do that. Friday and Saturday. Yeah, Friday and Saturday is when there are no tickets available. So can it? If you go on their website right now, there are zero tickets available for Friday and Saturday. And you can't buy a four-day pass right now. So, we're trying to figure out how we're going to pull it off. But all of us want to go. I think we we turned Athena to the dark side with the convention thing. My dick did. Why? The people. Why? The people. Oh my god, the people are awesome. Crazy. Awesome. And, yeah, I like... In games, of course, I like... And drinks. Drinks are nice. But I didn't drink as much as I. Nobody drank. Well, no, Ruffles did. It was my birthday. I had two drinks. Ruffles drank more than anybody there. <laughs> wow, Ruffles. A grill? Um, No, she does not cook meats. In fact, she refused a steak from Texas. <laughs> Why do you gotta tell everybody? We stop at a Texas steakhouse. <laughs> Athena orders chicken. Chicken. I don't like steak. I don't like steak. Look at this. Look at this. Wait for it. Chat, get her. Get her. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> get her. Yes. Pepsi. Pepsi, yes. Pepsi you're just brown nosing because she's a chick. I'm on to you. But everybody else is what the fuck. Uh, Solace three for now. It'll be three again. It'll be me, Nomad. It might not even be Nomad. It might be two. We'll see. I'll let you know. We'll try for three, but probably two. 
Brownie points are good too. Yeah, no, see, Pepsi's a liar. He likes steak. Hashtag steak. Texas steak. Texas, we stopped at a fucking steakhouse. I got I a steak with Texas until in the we name. Stopped there. I knew we were going there, and I waited until we were stopped there, and I'm like, guys, I have a confession. I don't like steak. No kidding. We, talk, we talked about getting steak. Like, the drive through Texas is seven, eight hours of our drive. And Nomad and I talked incessantly about steak, 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 steak. And she waits until we're in the parking lot for her to go, I don't like steak. I don't eat steak in secret. There's no secret, secret about steak. This. Secrets. Hashtag secret steak. Do it. <laughs> Brother, you never. I... You know, the next time I raid you, it's going to be the secret steak raid. Oh, my God. It's going to be. It has to be. Brother, you can't say nothing <laughs> because you didn't give us an address. Yeah. Just yeah. saying. I checked my Discord, too. I got Yes, look at Pepsi. Steak but, is nasty. But for real, guys, we had a great time hanging out with people. Like, let's see. Uh, Expert Level Gaming, Fry, Fry Toy, uh, Rojo, and us. We had dinner in an awesome Italian place. Before that, we were hanging out with all those people. Mortanos, Tioni hung out with us for a long time. Ruffles hung out with us for a long time. Tofu was there. Just a bunch of people hanging out in the hotel lobby bar. Just... Drinking. Not even like drinking to get drunk. Just drinking and talking is. It was great. Amazing. It was fun. Everybody was cool. And I had to uh, show DJ and Bobo what's up on Harpoon Lagoon. Oh, yeah. That is true. He did. <laughs> he did. Bobo raged. It was great. Bobo uh, raged. Well, I mean, like, I sat down like this is my favorite game. Like, I don't get it. Me and Chris sit down immediately and just start racking up tickets and Bobo flipped his shit. She probably has a steak stash somewhere. Oh, I don't. I promise you. I do not. Brother, I'm on Discord and Twitter. If you at me, I'm going to check it. It gives me a notification. Or if you send me a personal message, it'll give I me a notification. I have notifications for all of it. Yeah, anything on, on our channel, I get notifications for. I yeah. was literally on my phone the whole time because I was the only one not driving. I don't know who won the Omegathon because we did not actually get Sunday passes. Oh, here's another fun story. We did not actually get Sunday passes. <laughs> However, security was really, really lax. Like, really lax. So we all snuck in on Sunday. We all got in. The first time. Yeah, and then we went out, come back in, and I'm the only one that gets checked, and I get kicked out. Why, they go have their fun. We did have fun, too. It was a good time. I got to play Party Hard 2 for a little while. That game was super fun. I got to play the first one now. So Party Hard's going to happen in the near future. But Party Hard 2 was a lot of fun. I enjoyed that. Uh, I got to talk to a couple more devs because it was Sunday and it was slow. Hung out with a couple more partners. Meet some new friends. What were you I doing? I don't want to hear that. I what was sitting doing? outside. Sitting outside. On my phone. Why did you get caught? We didn't get caught. We went in at the same time. Why did you get I caught? I went in through the door where the lady was checking everybody. And, all right, so there was a guy who was there previously, the first time, who was very lax on badges. And then right next to him, there was a lady. This lady was scouring every badge. So Nomad and I walked past the guy, furthest away from the lady. Athena just tried to walk right up the middle. And she's like, excuse me, miss. Excuse me, miss. And we turned around and we saw Athena, and Athena's just like, fuck, oh, guys. Oh, guys. <laughs> oh, it was so bad. I That's tried really to pull it off too. I tried. I'm like, they're right here. Yeah, those enforcers. I mean, they got a job to do. They just look, there's no metal detectors here. They half ass check the bags. Like, I cannot stress how poor security was at PAX. It I do a lot of cons, anime cons, comic cons, all these big things. I've never seen security so bad. Even even a small con like Cincinnati Comic Con was really, really rigid on their security because of what happened in Phoenix last year. And if you guys didn't hear about that, there was guns and weapons brought in that weren't cosplay items, legit weapons. But after that, all the cons tightened up security, I guess, except the PAX series. I don't know. So PAX was really, well, lax on their security. I'm not complaining. I got a free Sunday out of it. Thanks, guys. I got half of a Sunday. I got a couple hours. 
<laughs> yeah. Um, but overall, PAX was really fun. Um, more than anything, it was the networking, the hanging out with people like Bicycle Walrus there, getting to have a drink with him at the bar was cool, uh, talking to Avenger devs about the Darwin project, getting to get reacclimated with them. Super duper cool. We don't have a comic in Germany like America, but. What is the IAA? I'm curious. Is that like just a general nerd con? There's your man's again. There's your man. <laughs> oh. I'm no, I... not a chance. Not even a little. Not even a chance. No, Scope was super cool, man. He was he was really welcoming. He's got one of those very gruff exterior faces. Like he looks like he wouldn't be that approachable, but super nice. Super duper. Uh, anybody have any questions, comments, concerns before we start talking about anything other than PAX? Because PAX was cool. I don't have, I don't have enough words to describe why you should go, especially if you're an aspiring streamer. If you plan on taking streaming seriously, you need to be going to these conventions. Even if you're just starting out, it's addicting. Hooks. Yeah, I'm hooked. Hooks. I will be, you know I will be. Do I know you be? Hmm. He does not know D-Way. We found D-Way to Texas. Yeah, no, I understand, brother. It, it was the same thing. Like I said, my, my house started flooding before we left. And I was like, fuck it, we gotta go. I, I have to go to PAX. So, Mr. Chomp Chomp dealt with it while we left. And now I get to pay for PAX in the flooded basement. Yay. So that's actually a good segue into what's going to happen going forward. So obviously you guys can see no green screen, no craziness, nothing here. I'll put some pictures up for you because that white wall is driving me crazy. I am sure it's going to drive you guys crazy. In the meantime, it's like plain. He is. I mean, it's my dog's room. He doesn't need pictures. But. I need pictures. And you guys need pictures. Uh, because we're not in the studio anymore, brother. We're upstairs because of a basement flood. That's why. I had the drain pipes in my basement come up about four to six inches. So basically, my entire basement was flooded with sewage water, which is a fucking delight. Now, granted, most of that water wasn't sewage water. It was melted No. It was diluted, and it's not as horrific as it could be, but it does not smell good down. And I have a restoration com company coming out today or, tom or tomorrow or the next day. To start working on that, we're recarpeting. So we're going to redo the entire studio in preparation for some of the new shows that we're doing anyway. It's kind of a win-win. It just sucks that for two weeks or so, these are going to be... Well, or These accommodations are where we're going to be. This is kind of what we have to do for now. So that's one. Um, number two is after going to PAX, Marvel Factory, and us, really, really, really want to go to E3. So there is now a new goal. Let's grab this other. Grab this up. That's the new goal. Oh, yeah, absolutely, bud. Nice. Good to hear it, Zero. Very happy. And that's another thing that we're going to be doing soon, too. Uh, at the PAX panels, they did a streaming 101 and a streaming 201. And I think, I don't know, I'm not going to speak for Athena here, but my personal thoughts on it were they didn't cover enough. Like, they grazed on a lot of subjects, but they didn't go in-depth in a lot of things. But they did. They did help out a lot. Like, it wasn't... If you're just starting out, yeah. It helped out a lot. Like, what to do, don't lose hope. Have, like, no viewers and keep going. Right? Product placement. <laughs> it, it wasn't that the... Panels are bad. No, everybody that was on the panels, Lena, Anti Tinkerbell, Asika, Ruffles, all of those guys did a fantastic job doing it. But it's an hour long 
block of time that they have to give a slew of information about streaming. What I think, and this is something I discussed with uh, Sioni and Skofu a little bit, I think we're going to do a series of individual kind of, all right, this is 101, this is, you're firing up your Xbox and you're, this is 201, now you want to upgrade to capture card and OBS and bots, right? Okay, you're growing, how do you handle moderators, how do you handle funding, how do you handle X, Y, and Z? And kind of do a series of, in order, like how you should kind of approach streaming to eventually get to partner level. So that's something you guys can look forward to on YouTube. That will include some bot help stuff. Uh, so Nomad Scorp bot thing will be kind of expanded on and he'll do a Firebot one. We'll do some OBS ones. Metal Mario is a hacker. Uh, who wins, Metal Mario or Supersonic? Hmm, nobody knows. Bye, Rush here. All right, Zero, have a good night, man. It's Zero now. That's his gamer tag. And less German. But I like the German. What is fat? <laughs> Supersonic, see? It's already divided. Where is fat? I don't know. We're going to summon him shortly. Yeah, Fo Daddy was there. Now that right there is Skofu. That's Skofu. Askofu. Askofu. I know Skofu. I was in the mage. No? So, oh, uh, another thing that's coming up. Thursday, Thursday night, I believe, is the Monster Hunter demo. We'll do Monster Hunter on Thursday. We'll do Darwin this weekend. Destiny Raid Sunday, if you have the internet backs, maybe? maybe. Hopefully. Maybe. I have a cam now. But. But I don't have internet or a computer. You don't need the computer. The internet. Seems a little more crucial. Seems a little bit more crucial. Okay, guys, this is that rare opportunity where you have Athena on camera. You may ask her anything. That is not crass. Behave, adults. I know it's hard for a lot of you. Yes. Half of the things you talk about, Semper. I'm not going to tell you which half. <laughs> yes, you can use just about any webcam for your Xbox. It's just plug and play. Semper, you were brought up a lot at PAX. Just so you know. Yeah, actually, you were. Uh, a lot of jokes on you. A lot of jokes and a lot. <laughs> and when we had conversations about moderators, you came up a lot. Your iron fist. And then it turned into fisting jokes. I, I'm not stream boss, I don't think. I don't think it is her. Oh. I'm not stream boss. I am the boss. I'm not sure. Uh, uh, look who's, who's his brother. You're the stream boss. Look at you. Boss of the stream. When I do, yeah, it's yeah. going to be a minute. It's going to be a little while. She, and she's... when I do become stream boss, you're not going to be able to touch me as easily. I like that one. I touch you. Easily. Oh, dude, I heard Semper's voice when he typed that. He, oh, really? I I know that. I know uh, that's... I'm going to be throwing Big Boss stat down. I don't know. End of the month's coming up, and Semper did have, like, a little plan in mind. You're going to have to take it from him. Okay, I'll take it. You guys might need to do some teamwork, Solace, in Texas. You guys will... Brada! Yeah, we brought up brother a lot too, but it was always like brother, internet IRS, <laughs> those sexy men, that Rojo show, guys, goofy. Still one of my favorite pictures. Super sweet. Exactly. There's so many people there. No, oh, there's Lena. Lena sticks out because of her red hair. <laughs> and she's in the front. Yeah. But we have to close this down a little bit. Something called a tax refund coming. Hey, if you guys want to use your tax refund to help me fix my basement and improve our studio, well, let me just give you the hotline number. What's up, Fat? Fat! 
Jeez, Look what I found. I found a stray. It was out in the streets. We combed its hair and gave it a bath. Now it talks. Apparently, I'm super sassy. I know, right? No, it's definitely true. She's sassy as all. That's just the thing. Any other Pack South questions? Infinite Power questions? Athena questions? Marvel Factory questions? Anything? Because otherwise, we're going to start playing some Fortnite. That's yeah, I haven't played video games in a while. I need to play. My you like you like last year's packs better? What'd you like better about it, Machine Gun? I didn't go to last year. It might get you fat. Okay. Sandra made it already talked about that. Game or two, maybe. The Switch? Like the Switch presence or the debuting of the Switch console? No, it would have been Switch would have been before that. Or are we No, it was the year before that. In two years ago when they were showing off Switch. Mm. Mm. I don't know, this is my first pack. Mm. I hear East and West is better. Yeah, so Pack I'm South excited. is definitely the baby packs. This is more about networking opportunities than it is about the actual games and stuff. Need stream games now. What stream games? No baking. No baking tonight due to I came to what? You know, you can bake right while you watch. Reading that sentence makes me feel baked. Like, I don't know if I need to be high to understand what that meant. I want to play with my favorite fat man. Well, maybe we'll, we'll work something out. <coughs> It's up to her. She's the boss tonight. This is the queen. Yeah. We found a way because of the queen. So. All right, guys. Uh, if there are no further questions or commentary about PAX, we're going to go ahead and switch over to Fortnite. Uh, give me and just, I can get the hell out of here. Yeah, she can stop breathing on my neck. It's really uncomfortable. I always could beat him up on stream. Or we could spray you with, down with Silly String again. Yeah, I was on the phone, video chat, and this guy comes up and sprays me with Silly String. Everywhere. Silly String everywhere. It happened. I'm not lying. I, what am I going to do? Cover it up? Okay. So hang tight, guys. I'm going to go and stand by. I'm going to go get Athena set up with the Xbox downstairs, and we'll kind of go. Ben, all for you. This was the worst. I'm sorry to hear that. I thought it was great. I, I do a lot of conventions. I wasn't impressed with PAX as a convention, but I had a really good time hanging out with the Mixer staff and crew. They, the presence of the Mixer partners made the weekend oh, for me. And that's... There it is! <laughs> Semper, you're in timeout. How you like that? Hmm. What up, Meow? How's it going, dude? Hi, Meow! Stream a back a baking show and stop to watch the show, but I'm gonna cool. You're getting in on the cooking cooking philosophy of mixer. That's cool. Hi meow. Hello, meow meow. All this craziness. Alright. Um, to... Yeah. Oh. Alright, well, we're gonna go to standby. I'm gonna go make sure she's set up and then we will play some Fortnites with some of my favorite people. Get the fuck out! We'll be right back! <laughs>